Hello and welcome to Broken Age. I'm Black Star Aura. It's August the 23rd, 2016, a little after 8.30 p.m. Let's do it. Wait. Gotta have those subtitles. I wonder, I wonder if it's possible to play the whole game as one character or the other. Like Claire versus Leon of Resi 2. So they say that at any point you can switch between the two freely, but let's let's see what happens. What up? Leave me alone! Guess it's time to face the cupcakes. Come on, Bella. Everybody's waiting for you. Is that Raggedy Ann? What the shit? Gloria. Gloria, Bella. Wait, what's up here? Where the sweetness is baked right in. Are you doing this on purpose to bug me? You're bugging me, shit. Well, did you get eaten by a bear? Bears rock. If so, then I know you're lying because we don't have bears around here. Shut up, Raggedy Ann. There you are. I was getting worried. Jesus. Worried that I chickened out? No! I know you're not afraid of anything. I mean, what's to fear? This is a great honor. Right! Wait, I can't tell if you're being serious. No, there is one part that I'm really afraid of. What's that? I'm afraid that you won't get any food because I'm gonna beat you to the Maiden's Feast. Dream on! Shut up. Shut up, you guys. She's coming. Hello? Is this my birthday? Shh. No backing out now. <coughs> Surprise! Whoa. Yay! There is my Valoria. Oh, look at my pretty girl. I can't believe. I just can't believe. We're very proud of you. I think that's what your mother is trying to say. Oh, she's not even dressed yet? Can we do that after cake? Come on, cake first! All right, but come on. Let's get this good time over with. Okay, oh, Grandma. Yes, cake. Now, where did I put that knife? Nobody touches that cake until I find the ceremonial knife. <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh. What up, Grandma? Lavina? What is it, girl? Any idea where Mom's knife is? We're late. If I knew, I would have cut that cake, shoved it down your gullet, and had us out the door already. Oh. Can I ask you about the Maiden's Feast? Weren't you paying attention in Maiden training? Oh, damn it!
How many of these feasts have you organized? Let's see. A new Grand Mog appears every 14 years, and I'd have seen six of them, so... Hey! Are you trying to get my age out of me? I'll never tell. What is Mog Chathra? The latest in a long, distinguished line of Grand Mogs to visit our land. Distinguished? Well, anything that lives that long becomes distinguished. I mean, look at me! <laughs> Where do creatures like Mog Chathra come from? They come from beyond the Plague Dam. I want to go beyond the Plague Dam someday. It's forbidden! But maybe you'll be lucky enough to be taken there soon in Mog Chathra's stomach. Uh... Am I gonna die? How much do we know about these Grand Mogs? The Grand Mogs have visited our lands for as long as anyone can remember. They hide in the wilderness for years, and then they come to feed. On me! After feeding, they return to their land and, it is imagined, breed. You actually imagine that? Eh. Why was I chosen? In every town visited by a Grand Mog, the villagers vote for the maidens who represent their town's best qualities. So in other words, beats me. Yeah, lovely. We are tribute. Mob Chathra attacks other towns? Of course. Merilof just had their maiden's feast yesterday. That's how we know he's coming here next. They're a pretty tough act to follow. Amazing feather work. Okay. I think I know all I need to know about the maiden's feast. All you need to know is how to look pretty in your dress. We'll take care of the rest. So, why don't we just fight Mog Chathra? Silence! Talk like that could ruin the Maiden's Feast. If you destroy the feast, Mog Chathra will destroy this village, including your family. Is that what you want? No. My grandpa doesn't look too happy about this feast. Your grandpa is just stuck in the ways of old. Your grandma was the same way. And bless her soul. Not all of the town elders have stayed as hip and with it as I have. Oh, I'd better go look for that knife. And hurry. If we're late, you won't be selected and your family will be shamed. Grandpa Beastender? <laughs> Do you know where Mom's knife is? <laughs> Wouldn't tell you if I did. I'm not doing one thing to help with this shame feast. Yeah, I'm not sure how I feel about this Maiden's Feast either, to tell you the truth. Then fight it, girl! Stand up for yourself! I hope you're not filling that girl's head with nonsense, Brummel. Hmm. Oh, I like him. Why do you hate the Maiden's Feast, Grandpa? Because this used to be a town of warriors. It's a travesty, Bella. Why'd we stop being warriors? Levina Clench and her ilk said there was too much bloodshed pushed for a piece. So we went soft. Became a town of bakers. Hey, Gramps, want a cupcake? <laughs> yes. I'd better go find that knife. Don't you dare. I hid it for a reason. You did what? Oh, nothing. Yeah. Grandpa Beastender? <laughs> I'd better go find that knife. Hmm. Don't suppose you have another knife in the back we can use? I do, but your mom brought out a special one she wants to use. She wants everything to be perfect on your special day. You sure this Maiden's Feast is a good idea, Pops? I... It's what you want, right? No. I guess so. I mean, you hear about it all your life. I'm just starting to wonder. Don't worry, sweetheart. You'll do great. Last chance to stop this thing, Pops. <laughs> you kidder. Yeah. Last chance to stop this thing, Pops. <laughs> you kidder. Know where Mom's knife is, Rocky? If I did, we'd all be eating cake right now! 
Uh, her family doesn't give a shit about her. You seem excited. I am. I think I'm gonna bark. That could be all the cupcakes you've been eating. I'm just sad I'm too young. I wish we didn't have to wait 14 years for another mog. I'll try to make you proud, Rocky. I'm already proud of you, stupid. Cupcakes. Oh my god. Yay! Cupcakes. Oh my god. Yay! Yeah, okay. Maybe the knife is under this towel. <laughs> Never gonna find it. Dad, I hope you're not hiding that knife for your own good. <laughs> One of my mom's special dish towels, and it's still dry. Kitchen? No. Not until I find that knife, young lady. She already caught me using my fingers. <laughs> Eyes in the back of her head, that woman. Yeah, okay. I hope that dress isn't to scale. How would I walk in that thing? Definitely some oh, where is that darn knife? Hey, don't go get dressed yet. I don't want you getting cake on your good outfit. Oh, a little frosting never hurt a maiden's feast gown? No backing out now. Too many people would see me. I think that's supposed to look like Mount Chathra. My handsome date to the prom. You're going to eat all of those? I've already had six! That explains a lot. It's just good to me. <sighs> Grandpa Beastender? <laughs> yeah, he doesn't. I'd better go find that knife. <laughs> just wondering, what if we fought the monster instead of feeding it? That's my girl. Now that's beast ender blood talking. Please, my loves, don't make this any harder than it already is. <laughs> Mom, I was just wondering, what if we fought the monster instead of feeding it? That's my girl. This thing, Pops. Hey, don't go get dressed yet. Okay, it has to be in this room then. Lavina? What is it, girl? I'd better go look for that knife. Why is she flashing? Maybe having a little food in your belly would help you relax, Lavina. Having you in that monster's belly is the only thing that's going to help me relax. Oh, yes. bitch! No use mincing words at this point, child. Old bitch. It's today. Better not. One of my mom's special dish towels, and it's still dry. I don't want to mess up the frosting. 
He's already got a towel. Need a towel, Grandpa? Why? Well, look like some old drooling invalid to you. <laughs> One of my mom's special dish drying that won't help. If there is a day to splurge, it's today. For me? For you, Grandpa. Don't mind if I do. Grandpa Beastender? Yeah. Hey, Gramps, want a cupcake? Um, yes. I better go find that knife. <laughs> okay, that did something. I hope that dress isn't to scale. How would I walk in that thing? Why not? I'm too nervous to eat. For me? Split it with you? Deal. Oh. On second thought, you can have the whole thing. Suit yourself. Now, where did I put that thing? What thing? No, uh, nothing. Uh, I didn't say anything. All right. <laughs> Killer. All right, time to serve this girl up. But first, can I ask just one more time, honey? Why don't we just kill Mom Chothra? <laughs> <laughs> here, here! <laughs> oh, honey. Oh, we're going to miss your sense of humor. Yeah, they're so... They're so, uh... Resigned to losing they're you, aren't they? to behold. Oh, inspiring. Powerful. Mysterious. But Mom Chothra is more than that. Merciful and generous, Mog Chopra keeps our town safe. All he asks is may he pick some of our beautiful flowers as he passes through. Please come, Mog Chopra, and make your selections. Welcome to the Maiden's Feast. So much of Maiden, Ella. I know she'll pick you. This can't be right. Yeah, whatever, bitch. Just wanted to say good luck. Bye. Sorry, but beauty's nothing without a little heat. Hey, I've got a plan. I already have a plan, thanks. Attract Mog Chopper with my slender frame and be remembered forever as a hero. Well, good luck. Yeah, <laughs> whatever. Fuck you. <laughs> When the monster gets close, you can use your candles to burn its eyes. Don't distract me. I think I've got a chance to win this. Hey, does that costume have any thorns we can use as weapons? It does, but they're made out of chocolate. Regardless, I accept my noble burden, not with apprehension, but with... Sure. You're a dumbass. So that no harm comes to our village. No, I give my life. No, me. Sheesh. I hear him. Look, there he is. Oh, 
Oh, Jesus. Oh, now they're acting sad. to shred this thing, it might be. Glad I'm not wearing that anymore. No way am I putting that thing back on. Gotcha. That's it. Black those big blue wings. Just a little bit harder. Come on, girl. Give it all you've got. Yes. Yeah. 
badass. Ha 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 ha!